hurt my feelings. <laughs> what are I doing? We need to take the Why do we have a day with Welcome to this week's Week in Review. Special guest Audrey. Big clap. Big clap. Okay. All right, starting off as normal with our Bright Spots of the Week, starting on Monday. Jacko smashing his first bar muscle up, which means he is officially has muscle ups both ring and bar, so well done Jack. Pretty cool to see you smash that and to see your progress and well done. Also on Monday, Marine was hitting some perfect technique on the jumping bar muscle ups, so full bar muscle ups coming your way very soon. Just keep working at it, Marine. Tuesday, to give a shout out to Hannah for destroying the row, that's Hannah Lotes, and then Sammy for crushing the bike as well. Both did very well. <clears throat> uh, so well done, you guys, I appreciate your push and then also on Tuesday afternoon give a shout out to Jacinta for going so hard that she failed her last two sets of bench press and that's the kind of intensity you want when you're getting strong. Wednesday a is in the morning so she's obviously just thrown out 8,000 bright spots. <laughs> Good job to Sydney for coming back after doing some rehab. Let me know if you ever need any help at all. Sammy RX running workout so good job Ma destroying the workout on Wednesday as well and hitting 6am Rich's positions in the clean and jerks were looking really really good so well done Rich and then Rosie and Ali also in the afternoon stepping up after a little push from the coach to demolish their clean and jerks as well so well done the clean and jerks was a hard one on that day I appreciate the intensity Thursday we had some chin ups and shout out to Danny for surprising yourself a little bit but then smashing out all the body weight chin-ups uh, in that one. So well done Danny, strict body weight chin-ups with triples and stronger every day mate. And then on Friday, I want to give a shout out to Alex Ellis, who's just a quiet achiever. I notice you Alex, I see you going hard, I see you working at it, and you're really doing really well. So I appreciate your intensity and your trust in us. Good job. And then also on Friday, we had a couple visitors to the gym we had Etienne, which is Hannah Lee's husband, and then River as well came down. So thank you team for coming down, and I uh, hope to see you again soon. And then Saturday, I want to give a shout out to Gauza and Jess for absolutely demolishing a workout. Jess is scaling, which is totally fine. She's got a bit of a baby belly, and then is just going hard as always. Team, you are inspirational. Let's see my daddy again. Okay. Cool. So, events have just gone. This Monday we had our Never Miss a Monday Challenge, which is now under full swing. So if you missed Monday, boom, you're out, sorry. But just remember that this coming Monday, we have a public holiday. We're running 9.15 class only. We have a fun hero workout to do. A lot of people keep asking me what the hero workout is. Oop, out of focus, it's focusing on my leg. There we go. And the hero workout is pikey, I believe. So look it up, pretty hard. I'm not going to put it up on the screen because it looks pretty difficult. Yeah, 9.15 on Monday and never miss a Monday challenge in full swing. This Monday doesn't count, remember, uh, but bonus points if you do come down. It doesn't really mean anything. Speaking of things, so that was well done. So then coming up in the future, I floated an idea the other day to do a bit of a movie night. Instead of just watching movies at the gym, we're going to erg the whole time. So it'll be an erg movie night. What is erg? Erg. So like the rowing erg and the bike erg and the air bikes and the ski erg. Yeah. Cool. So what we'll do is we'll pick a movie. Uh, I'll put a post up. I can only have 15 people in theory because skiing while watching a movie is kind of hard. Rich mentioned that he might be able to hook us up with a 130 inch projector. I'll hook up the PA system and then we'll just get a Friday night erg in and get a bit of a sweat on. Two hours worth of erging 
and watch a movie at the same time. So fitness and entertainment all in one. Uh, depending on what movie we want to watch will depend on how long we go for. Conversation pace. Um, if that doesn't sound like your jam, then don't come. But if it does sound like a shape bit of a challenge that you want to do, then uh, come down. It'll be 5.25, it'll, it'll start the movie essentially. So there is no brief or anything, it'll be let's put the movie on and we'll just start urging um, in that position. So 5.25, 21st of June, day before my wife's birthday. Cool. A couple of other things that happened this week, we had Tommy versus Geelong challenge. Tommy seems to be unbeatable for this week, so what on Tommy? I put in a really crazy effort on that one, and that was inspirational. I couldn't beat it, so not that I'm that fit, to be honest. <laughs> not compared to Tommy. But this Monday we'll have an additional Tommy vs Geelong challenge. We'll probably shoot it quickly just before or after the workout. Probably after, so everyone can yell at him. Big Tommy vs Geelong challenge. Look out for it. Speaking of Tommy vs Geelong challenge, if you have a small business and want to sponsor the Tommy vs Geelong challenge, honestly, you'd probably never be up for anything because Tommy's unbeatable, but let me know. I can put your name on all the flyers and we can just advertise this stuff. I don't think people really mind too much. It's just about building the community. I have one for next week, but I still need two more. So if you're keen and want to throw a lunch in or something, uh, please feel free to let me know and we'll hook you up, give you some publicity. Fun Club is still on every Saturday, in case you didn't know. One o'clock, Eastern Park, main barbecue area. Don't cost zero dollars to get better at running technically and conditionally wise, so make sure you get on board that if you want to get better at running. Sauna's up and running, also in case you didn't know, Still haven't got my rocks, I need some more rocks, so just no water on it, but it heats up at about three degrees per minute, so you can get some pretty hot sauna action going. It's not even maxed out yet too, so I'm interested to see what that will do. Might hit up Dave Nichols, see if he wants to have a sauna. Dave, if you're watching, let's have a sauna. And then I think that's pretty much what we got going on. I want to do a few other things as well, but I'm just working on some stuff in the background, so bear with me while I organise all that, but we have our movie night, we have our Never miss a Monday, and we'll look for some more things to do. If you think of anything you want to do, um, I want to try and get this beach volleyball uh, little creatures day up and running, so we'll try and organise that as I go along. Um, and then finally we have our programming, in case you didn't know. So we did a three strength elements this week. So we did our bench press pull-up, we did our cleans and jerks, and we did our back squat chin-up. And then so next week we'll have our front squat and odd object pull. We'll have our lift deadlift and dips and we'll also have the snatches and abs cool and so we'll do three of those plus we'll have our 20 minute am wraps we have our tommy v the world we have our sprint chippers and we have monday hero workout as well so programming is really dialing in settling in nicely it seems initially i'm one week in but i'm quite enjoying it let me know if you're enjoying it too I know CrossFitters do a lot of CrossFit for a variety. If you want to get better at something, you have to do it pretty consistently. So I hope at least with those six things, we can get a bit of variety with our programming and there yeah, you enjoy it. If you're finding it a little bit boring, let me know. And then if enough people say it, then I'll switch it up. I just wait until enough people tell me that it's kind of boring. So we can review, it's pretty simple. What do you reckon, Zoe? I've got Zoe here. i got Audrey here. Did you want to say something, Audrey? What's, uh, what's your brother and sister's name? Julia and Mocky. Julia and Mocky. They're your cousins. Is it nice outside? You want to do math on the video? Alright, what's uh, 5 plus 6? 11. 11, good job. What's 10 plus 10? 20. What is 7 plus 7? 15. Ooh, try again. 14, good job. Cool, there you go. Math brought to you by Audrey. Alright, we can review. I'll see you in the gym. back in but did I mention I want a volunteer to help me do a documentary on their CrossFit experience if you've made it this far and you're there hit me up because I want to try something that I haven't done before and obviously the first time you do it it's always bad but I need that person to help me be bad at something initially so that's you let me know